Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying a few new uh, random snacks that we found while we were out. This is the new Russell Stover sugar-free made with stevia extract. They're can uh, chocolate candy coated peanuts. They have the Crunch and Munch cookies and cream popcorn clusters. So the cookies and cream popcorn clusters were $3.99 at Walgreens. The Russell Stover was $5.99 at Kroger. So we're gonna try it first because it's sugar-free. And so this was on a special display. If you follow me on Instagram, it's Tammy's Clock, all one word. Um, I posted a picture of the display at Kroger. It was up front. So uh, that's what caught my eye. And it says new in gold. I like that. Uh, chocolate candy coated peanuts in a colorful candy shell. 7.5 ounces. It says uh, sugar free made with stevia extract. A fourth of a cup is the serving size. Seven servings are in the container. One fourth cup, 31 grams is 120 calories. And that was very easy to open. Ooh, these are much bigger than I thought. They smell uh, chocolatey. They are big, I'm telling you. Because I was expecting them. The size of an M&M. Yeah, well, some of them are the size of them, but then you got, I think there's two peanuts there. There's, Those that, looks like, like. that looks like a little slime in a game. They count as one. That looks like a slime in a game. Go. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> and they do, there's plenty in here. There's plenty left. I'm going to get one of these dark ones because I want, no, I'm going to get a light one. Oh. I want to see how the dye is in that. Yeah, I want you to see the dye. So are you going to get a light one? one? I'm going to get one, the one that you were the double flop, peanut. flopping around. Hmm. I want to try this darker dye. There's not much to those. I like it. I like it. I like the texture. Now I guess the flavors are okay. I don't even really get a peanut flavor from it though. No, I don't either. I like the texture quite a bit. It would remind you of a peanut M&M. But it's it, softer. It, that's exactly what I was going to say. Yeah, it's a softer chocolate. We finish each other's sandwiches. Um, yeah, it's a softer um, softer texture mm -hmm. than a peanut M&M. Yeah, the chocolate inside softer. And I think it has more chocolate surrounding that peanut mm -hmm. and that's what makes it softer. Yeah. Because an M&M, love M&M's, not taking anything away from M&M's, but it's not as thick of a chocolate layer. Right. And these, since they're thicker, I mean, Russell Stover's known for the chocolate. Um, it's a thicker layer, so it does make it softer. And I love the colors. The colors are very bright, vibrant You need to make sure you leave out one of each color so I can get a picture. Yeah, I think you've got them all there. Yeah, yeah you have a violet color and green, yellow, yeah. red, blue. They're very pretty. Yeah. Easter like If, if you need sugar-free, I would say get those because yeah. I like them. If they're sugar-free, 100% they're good. But in a peanut M&M, you taste the peanut. I don't get any peanut. I did not get the peanut flavor here. I mean, I got the texture of it, but I never tasted it. No, it <laughs> which is weird. It. Yeah, but it's covered up completely. Yeah, but I good. still think if you need sugar-free, those are good. Yeah, I good. was more impressed than I thought I would be. Yeah, because we've had sugar-free stuff before. It's horrible. <laughs> These are the and they're in a bag, the way. Yeah, cookies and cream. Now we have reviewed, I believe there was a birthday and a brownie one. We've already reviewed those a long time ago and we're just getting these to our area. I think these have been out, the, the cookies and cream, they say new. I think they've probably been out for a little while and we're just now getting them here. Popcorn clusters, they're white chocolate glazed popcorn with chocolate cookie crumbles and Dutch cocoa cookies. It says the same thing on the back. Uh, half a cup is 140 calories, and there's five servings in the bag. Once again, resealable bag. Which is nice. Mm. Nope, it's okay. It smells okay. I don't know if it's a cocoa. Oh. It's supposed to have like little cookie pieces. I mean, oh, yeah. Do you cookies. see on the back it says it had cookie dough? Dutch cocoa cookie chunks. Chocolate cookie that. crumble. See that? And white chocolate glazed popcorn. Dutch chocolate cookie chunks. Maybe those are in the bottom. What's these dark pieces? On there? I think it's. 
It could just be these dark I think pieces. it's the dark pieces on there. Oh, no, no, no. Look, there's yeah, one. Yeah, there's one right here. It's attached. That's like hard like an Oreo. These are okay. I prefer the um, the regular Crunch and Munch. The caramel corn kind of flavor with the, don't they have peanuts in them? Maybe they don't. I, don't, I can't remember. Or is it that other brand? Um, I can't remember. Anyway, Crunch and Munch is good. I just like the caramel flavor better. What was that brand that mom and dad used to buy? And it was absolutely phenomenal. It had a weird name. Yeah, this is a, like Higgledy Piggledy or something. Something like that. Yeah, it's something like that. Literally. It has a weird name. Uh, I think it begins with a K. I cannot think of it. Um, it is weird. The name is. Oh shoot! Anyway, that uh, I th and it had peanuts. I think uh, doesn't. I think regular Crunch and Munch has peanuts in it too. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Actually, I really. I, it's not the sweetest and the flavor is just okay for me though this would be addictive because i like the crunchiness of it i like the texture so much i like the texture of everything but those cookies the cookie pieces are too hard they're like eating a, a, a thick oreo and they're very yeah hard. and i didn't mind it yeah. i really didn't that along with the popcorn kind of tastes I'll, like an oreo honestly. i'll have to find another piece to take a picture of because you didn't get very many of those. I mean, was it like funky, crunchy, or something? Fun it almost sounds dirty when you say when you when you say. You it. think so? I always thought it. I um, I will find out the name of it and I will put it on the screen because it was. I love the name of it. Uh, we just don't buy it because it's so high in calories, mm -hmm. and you we we would eat the whole uh, whole package of it. Um, but uh, anyway, I'll put the name of it on the yeah. screen because so, it was something really cute. For me, I would eat it, but it's not one I would buy. I'd rather have the caramel. Uh, the Russell Stowers, if you need sugar-free, it's definitely a sugar-free alternative. So. And just know, you don't get a lot of those Dutch cocoa cookie chunks. Which is good for me because I didn't like You don't either. get a lot of those, but I'm going to make sure you see a picture of one. Um, it's just a little bitty cookie disc is what it is. Poppycock. Poppycock. That's it. Which... Sounds kind of dirty. <laughs> <laughs> poppycock. Yeah. That's it. Poppycock. Uh, yeah. I knew I would think of it sooner. My right. parents had that stuff around. Uh, once I moved out of the house, uh, they they anytime we would come over, they would have a container of poppycock sitting mm -hmm. around, and that stuff was gold. Yeah. It was. Crunch and Munch is the same way. If you get the corn, you know what? Really I don't even too. know if we've ever reviewed poppycock for the channel. I don't know. I have Lots no idea. Um, but. Honestly, uh, this is not bad. I think I would prefer the other, uh, the birthday or the brownie mix that oh, they the have color. out. Um, and just, the, the, yeah, or just the original. Mm. Yeah, the original uh, Crunch and Munch. But if you have to go sugar free, I'll, I think right, they did a good job with those. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.